All right, number 12 um, says, suppose we have the x-intercepts of the graph y equals f of x and they are four and five. What are the intercepts of the graph of f of x plus four? So we need to think about what does this plus four do to the graph? Okay, the plus four positive will shift the graph left. So it would be the same idea as taking my x-intercepts and moving them to the left four units or subtracting four. So if I did that, took away four from four, that would leave us with zero. And my other intercept, if I took away four from the five, that would leave me with a positive one. So we just take those and shift them to the left four units. What would be the x-intercepts of f of x minus seven? So in the same sense, this minus seven in parentheses here uh, will shift that right seven units. So we will add seven to these two numbers this time. So four plus seven will give us 11 and five plus seven will give us 12. So in effect, it will shift our intercepts right. And then the nine on the outside, this will um, shift or this will multiply our y value by nine. Now, when we deal with the x-intercept, the y value is zero because we're on the x-axis. So any point on the x-axis, we have an order pair. X is a number and y is zero. So if I multiply zero times nine is still zero. Doesn't affect that x-intercept, it'll be the same position. So in this instance, um, our x-intercepts are unchanged. They're unaffected by the multiplication of nine by the y-value. So we would still have x-intercepts of four and five. <clears throat> On D, we would multiply our x coordinate by a negative one. Or actually you wanna do the opposite. So remember how we saw a negative we add and we saw a positive we subtract. So same likewise when we have a, a number in here, we would divide. So I would divide by negative one. And in this case, it will do the same thing as multiplying by negative one but that's what you do with the x values inside. You would actually divide by this number. So we would divide by negative one and they will still come out uh, negative four and negative five. Same as if we multiply by negative one. But remember the rule is to divide. That's what we're doing here.